Hey guys, it's the Ruffled Rabbit here. This is my new Lop Rabbit Aladdin. I just got him a couple days ago. So this video is just going to be a haul about all the things I got for him and everything that I've purchased leading up to buying him and everything for him. So enjoy! So first from Walmart.com I ordered these storage cube grids. I ordered two sets of 12 so I got 24 but this is just what I used to build the cage. And then I also got some zip ties from Walmart to make the cage for the rabbit. And I just put the zip ties and zip tied all the grids together. Uh, from PetSmart I got this Critter Care Bedding. It's for small animals and I use this as litter. You can see I've already used some of it but it's a super absorbent and it expands like to twice its size or something so I just put that in the litter box and that's what absorbs the pee and poo. From Walmart next I got this little litter scooper. It was like 98 cents and I just got it so I can scoop the poop up to put in the litter box or to clean out the litter box so that's gonna help. Next I got from Petco these Sunburst Veggie Sticks, just a little treat. It's uh, all natural, healthy vegetable sticks, just little crunchy sticks made from carrots and beets and other vegetables, so I heard rabbits really like them. Next from Walmart, I got this willow ball. It's just a little shoe ball made of willow and it has little walnuts inside that uh, I heard rabbits like to chew and throw around and stuff, so that will be good for a rabbit. Next from Walmart I got these baby keys and they're like little monkey faces and they're kind of big and clunky but this is the only keys that Walmart had so I just got those for my rabbit to throw around. From PetSmart I got these cat jingle balls and uh, it's just two different colors and it has a little bell inside so you can shake it around and I heard rabbits really like to throw these around so I got four of those little jingle balls. Then from Walmart, I got a cat brush. This is just a regular brush with bristles with rubber ends, and I just got this for grooming my rabbit and to help get some of the fur off. I also, from Walmart, got a cat flea comb, which is double-sided. One side has wide bristles, and the other side has closer together ones, but I just got that for extra combing on my rabbit. Next from Walmart is some cat nail clippers. So I got these. I heard that you can use them on rabbits just fine. I just got these to trim my rabbit's nails when they get long and just to clip. I haven't opened them yet, you can see, but I'll be using those. Next from Petco, I picked up a small crinkle tunnel, which said it was for dwarf rabbits. And my rabbit's not a dwarf, but uh, he's small enough where he can fit in this. So it's a little crinkle tunnel. It has a hole on the side and obviously on the two ends, but you, you can just crinkle it up for easy storage when you're done. It just crinkles into a small little circle, so it stores easy and rabbits really love to run through tunnels and stuff, so I got this. Also from Walmart, I have this auto water bowl that uh, whenever they drink out of it, the water just goes back in and refills itself. I also got a small cat bowl, which is just where I put the pellets for my rabbit to eat. Then I got this Rubbermaid bin from Walmart which I just turned into a litter box, just a cheap litter box. You can see it's filled with litter and poop already, but um, I bought this Rubbermaid bin from Walmart. And then from PetSmart, behind the litter box is a plastic hay rack, which is filled with hay, you can see. And that's how they get their hay through that. That's everything that I've got for Aladdin so far. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.